Grandpa Newbie reporting for duty with a PDSW 528. Is it any good in Modern Warfare 3? So I played Free For All. There it is compared to the, dam uh, the Rival 9, and you can see that the bullet velocity is significantly better. The Rival 9, the minimum damage range is better. Everything else is pretty much the same. Blue means pretty much the same. Green means significantly better. So, as far as the damage is concerned and the ranges, they're very similar. Let's look at the metrics now. Exactly the same for the time to kill and headshots upper and lower torso. Now, the one big difference is the aim down sight speed. Significantly different in favor of the Rival 9 and the reload quickness. But if you look at comparing 50 rounds to 50 rounds, the PDSW is actually faster because it carries 50 rounds. So I bebopped around this new map here. It's the first time on it. Pretty interesting place. Looks expensive by the night. And yes, my proximity mines did do some work. I was behind three to nothing before I even realized what was going on. There's somebody upstairs. And the guy that gacked him, gacked me. What is this? Air conditioning vent. There's a gacker waiting in the vent. Always is. Just like at home here. Can't hardly go into any vent in my house without somebody trying to gack me. So I bebopped around. Now the one thing questionable in my configuration, and I'll show you the entire configuration in a second, was the laser. I'm not a fan of lasers in free-for-all because the laser points to where you are, but this particular laser does not shine at the hip. So you can read my hips. You can't read my hips. You have to read when I'm aimed down sights. So you got to re read the lips, whatever that means. So I'm still behind by three kills. We start out zero to three. Halfway through the game, it's zero to three. Now, that's one thing that I wanted to show was that the ADS movement speed is significantly better than the Rival 9 for the PDSW. And you saw a demonstration of that right there. The guy probably couldn't follow me too well. I looked like I was banging my head off the walls. And then luckily I have people that run in front of me. It gets me up to a tie game at this point. And I had no clue where to put the turret. I think I got two of them in this game. And I never had a clue where to put it. In fact, I'm trying to put it down now and I'm throwing things. And I get gacked. I get gacked because I'm incompetent with the turret. Hopped over the bar. It's against bar rules. So I get gacked. Hop over it again. This time it wasn't the bar. You're supposed to use the stairs in this hotel. Or this estate, whatever it is. And there somebody's trying to gack me. <laughs> and I roll into a corner and kill somebody else's proximity mine. How dare they? Only Grandpa and Newbie's allowed to use proximity mines in free-for-all. So I run around looking for people, and I couldn't find anybody anywhere. And I did manage to build a lead. Heard that guy coming. Sounded like a herd of wild elephants. There's the entire configuration. You can see which laser I used there. It helped with the aim down sight speed because it's pretty slow for an SMG. But otherwise, awesome weapon. Now, this wasn't a Snickers win. It's not satisfying when you don't get to 30 points. So I took it in one more free-for-all and immediately get gacked because I'm putting my bullets beside them and not in them. And that guy was distracted and got me a double kill. And once again, I fall behind to somebody called Troll. And that was Troll, the tactically sequined party girl. Trolled was my nemesis, and you got to wonder about a name like Trolled. First of all, how did they get it? Second, does it mean anything? I'm not sure. 
Now, the tactical sprint speed was what sets the PDSW apart. I felt like I had super speed in these games. It, it was amazing. And super speed without aftermarket steroids like some people pay for. Putting out the proximity mine behind by two to trolled the tactically sequined party girl. And there she is. Always good to kill the king. Reels them in a little bit closer to the boat there. Somebody killed my kill. But I managed to get them. And like a pirate, I'm bloodthirsty. <laughs> that poor guy didn't have a chance. He's aiming down sight with a sniper rifle and I come sliding past him. And he tried to put a granado in my ear. He managed to gack me. So I'm neck and neck with Trolled, the tactically sequined party girl. In the middle of the map is where all the action happened. You could gack and get gacked anytime. Love the word revenge. And there, the guy's updating his camping membership. Like it interrupted him as he was setting up his tent. Up by four here, but it wouldn't last. Because trolled what was never done with me. There she is. Hi. Didn't get away though. There's that poor guy with a the sniper rifle. There's trolled again. Every time I kill trolled, I get gacked. I guess it must be her boyfriend following her around. And now I'm losing, and it's at the end of the game. And I'm even tied, but I'm still losing somehow. Jumped over that guy and then get gacked by trolls. Now I know trolled has 29. I'm desperately looking for 30. And there it is. My thoughts on the PDSW, it's worth trying. It is a good gun in Modern Warfare 3. There are a lot of good SMGs, and it's SMG-centric now. So please like and subscribe. Helps me. Helps the family. Cheers and peace.